Cause when you're reaching the fat, well, you know you're gonna get some iron, need some iron, hold some iron, party monarch iron, you're gonna get my. Ricardo Drew is a son of the soil. Somebody that just wants to change your life with music. Um, I'd, I'd like to say that I'm a very, I don't know, I, I'd like to say that I, I connect well with people. I like to say that I, I, I like to share my messages through my music. I mean, I, I don't think, if, if you're an overall musician that listens to all types of genres, there's no way that you, you can't have influence from, from these, types of, these types of music, this, these types of genres. Matt Decent is Diplo's, Diplo from Major Leisure, his label. Um, and they basically just gave us a single deal for Vagabond. Um, so they've been pushing Vagabond on, on the mainstream circuit. My creation process. I can tell you my creation process starts with rum and ends with rum. <laughs> No, um, creation process is different, man. It, it depends on the song, it depends on the direction we're going, it depends on, on what we're trying to create. You know, sometimes we'll sit in the studio for about hours, couple hours well, and, and not get anything, and then sometimes we'll have to go out and enjoy and see different things and, and be a part of a different scenery. Ha! Ah, how do you keep getting victories and remaining on top? It's very difficult. Especially in the soca world, um, I, I will say soca is the only genre of music where you have to produce hits every six months to a year. It used to be groovy, you know. It, it used to. I, I used to be like, nah man, I'm not, I'm not a power singer, I'm not a jumpy singer. And then I kind of fell in love with up-tempo. Um, so I don't really have a particular favorite, I like them both. The, the year that I had Vagabond, the semi-finals, I think that was for me, that was the first time that I actually saw people react to me in, in, in a way that said, you know what, yeah boy Ricardo, you're on your way to something. We could start off with my, my charity event, IDLAN. IDLAN is a event catered wholly and solely towards the children of Antigua and Barbuda and all the proceeds go back to the children. We also have a drive called ID Care where we, you know, we're creating little areas where we can give food back to, to the homeless for Christmas and, and you know, Thanksgiving and these other things. 